we'll have so much fun together. At least I will. Hey guys, it's just little Skelly Boy, and today we're at the Spear Halloween in East Greenbush, New York, uh, Columbia Turnpike Plaza. Um, I've been excited to go to this one because this is like my favorite store of my locals. Okay, so here's the Carnival Archway. I don't understand why, but the uh, like risers are kind of pushed to the side, which is weird. But I guess we'll just get going ghost face real quick. He's holding uh, the newspaper. Now I see something red. <laughs> As always, no ringmaster yet. I don't think really any stores are going to have the ringmaster anytime soon. Walk through the Carnival ISC. Let's get the Wheel of Fate. See what I get real quick. Winner, you get to keep your skin. Okay, well, I don't know that was what was on the line. Here's Max Straw. I don't believe he's on as of right now, but um, he's pretty cool. And we met him today. You want to say anything? And I've never, ever seen any of these animatronics here. Yeah, I mean, this is the brand new year, so they got new oh, merchandise crap. and stuff. Down the duck tent. Now it's time for Donald Duck. Those are normally for the animatronic activators, but they don't really have anything. We got, he's not on either, but he looks really good in here, especially since this store has a shorter ceiling. Definitely looks cool there. Sitting Scarecrow's back here. He's not on the animatronic activator, but I think if, yeah, sitting scarecrows right there. You can see the down the duck tent going, and they got some music playing there. Over here, there's Barnaby the Bear. I believe he's not on, and there's Jumping Spider, not on. Um, here is. Oh, they turned on the animatronics over there. Over here, they just turned on Giant Death Ray and Max Straw, so let's get a quick look at it. There's Rye Fry. Yeah, they just turned on Giant Death Ray and Max Straw. Giant Death Ray is on the sensor. He looks amazing, but I don't think his servo's going. No, it's not. So we're going to have to look at him another time when he's fully working. And then there's Max Straw set up right here. <laughs> They're still setting up Cotton Candy Dan over here. Um, he's gonna go there after they're done with him. Here's Nibbles the Clown. Oh, he's, he's looking at me. There he goes. Yeah, he's following me. We gotta get a restraining order against this dude. Let's get him going one more time. This is probably You've the best working motion eye. sensor I've seen since Don't flagship. Worry. I'm just admiring your costume. <laughs> hey, you over there. He's looking at yeah, you right now. You. I'm giving out some candy. I thought this would be a great way to make some friends. So come a little closer and try to take some. What do you we'll say? see you next time, Dan. <laughs> they also did turn on uh, Barney the Bear. I'm Barnaby the Bear, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, there he goes. His hair is very brushed down. Sir, I can't even see your eyes. They also turned on Jumping Spider right here. Yeah, check that out. And then let's go through the Fun House of Terror. 
It's definitely, there's the dispenser of the cotton candy scent. It's actually right there from uh, Froggy's. Uh, no hologram fan, surprisingly. I don't understand why, but still cool. They have a Dan right here, Bobby Strings, Nibbles the Clown, uh, three, five Pose and Stay skeletons, Foam Coffin, Barnaby the Bear. Here's Jack the Reaper. I haven't got a good look at him. $53 is almost a bit steep for what you're getting with him, in my opinion. I wanted to point out is that Grave Watcher is pretty much just going to be with all these guys like Ghost Swing, Empty Soul Girl on a Swing, and stuff like that. They have three Grave Watchers right here, but Tomb of Lost Souls set up. Uh, obviously, the photo booth stand right here, and obviously, that's the photo booth there. I see... I see two demonic gatekeepers back there. Interesting. We got some dolls. Is she saying, I love you, I love you? Or is she saying, I watch you, I watch you? We got Pestilent Pete. He does not sound good. We got the horror babies right here. Michael Myers, Pennywise, Ghostface. We got all these cool latex animals like this latex squirrel. Latex seagull, latex snail, latex crow, latex cat. They got the jumping spider section. Lots of jumping spiders in stock, but no gray one yet. Over here, we have the return to sender tombstone. How much is he? He's $45. And up there here, why he's never to return is also going off. Here's the Jack the Reaper archway. They do have only one of those in stock. Here they have like all the slasher stuff. Um, they got all the Chucky costumes, the Chucky masks. Look at this gnarly mask. That's actually a plastic sculpt, but that does look pretty good. They have all the shirts here. They have a lot of shirts. Let's see, do they have the ghost face with the middle finger? No, I don't think they have it, but there's what it looks like. Here's just a look at all of them. All the shirts, you can pause and check that out. Here's Elm Street. I like this little cardboard art right here. Freddy hat, Freddy costume. Some more Freddy hats. Not a lot of Freddy stuff. Oh, I spoke too soon. Check this out. Supreme Edition gloves. Let's see. They're made with real metal and they cost about $60. Here's some killer cons from outer space stuff. Like Shorty and uh, Jumbo. Now, they have a huge section of Ghostface merchandise this year. They have the whole kit right here with the Ghostface mask, the knife, the gloves, and the voice box. Here's the Terrifier section. Art is looking a little bit interesting today. We need to puff that face out. But there's his mask, the female Art the Clown costume. Uh, no male Art the Clown costume yet. Check out this Terrifier knife with his face and blood all along it. I love that. Oh my god, this sweatshirt is a must. Check that out. I love that sweatshirt so much. Look at this. They even have Terrifier socks. Those are very cool. What do you think of these guys? They're good boys? Yeah, we got the animals right here. You hate him? Is he too scary? He is pretty creepy. They do have all of the C uh, Series 3 bag clips. Um, I'm going to try to get some of those soon. Brought Dan to life over here. Yep, there's Dan. They got him going now. Uh, we met some really nice people in here, a lot of other fans and stuff, and um, it's a pretty cool store. Keep a look out throughout the week. Going to be a lot more videos in store tour, so thank you guys for watching. Make sure to catch me in the next one.